We joined up with Tom Boatner, who, after 30 years on the fire line, became chief of fire operations for the federal government. A fire of this size and this intensity in this country would have been extremely rare 15, 20 years ago. They're commonplace these days. 10 years ago, a big fire was what? 10 years ago, if you had a 100,000 acre fire, you were talking about a huge fire. And if we had one or two of those a year, that was probably unusual. Now we talk about 200,000 acre fires like it's just another day at the office. It's been a, a huge change. Uh, you know what? It's hotter than hell it's right getting, here. It's getting pretty damn hot. Whoa. <laughs> It is up. So you can see, you can imagine the challenge for young men and women with hand tools like this to come up here and try to put out a fire like this. We wondered whether Boatner thought one of the factors might be climate change. You know, there are a lot of people who don't believe in climate change. You won't find them on the fire line in the American West anymore because we've had climate change beat into us over the last 10 or 15 years. We know what we're seeing, and we're dealing with a period of climate in terms of temperature and humidity and drought that's different than anything people have seen in our lifetime. 